Bitterness, you'll be thankful when you hear my song. You have really got it made. If you're all in good, any place on earth but those things feel wood. It's a stretch of road up north in Maine that's never, ever, ever seen a smile. If they buried all the truckers lost in them woods, there'd be a tombstone every mile. Count them all. There'd be a tombstone. Honky Tonk Girl herself, and the Honky Tonk Hero of many, Loretta Lynn, still one of the greats. Big Sandy's Eclectic American Countdown Show.
Ladies and gentlemen, cowboys and cowgirls, outlaws and in-laws, welcome to Campus Jacks. It's a Saturday night, and we are broadcasting live around the world. If you want to share this with your friends, just have them go to Facebook, Stellar Shows and Concerts, join the party. Uh, this is the sixth out of seven Honky Tonk shows over 11 days. And that's a first for me. But I'm really proud to have presented right here on this stage. We had Reckless Kelly. We had Jesse Dayton. We had Slade Cleaves. And we had Robbie Falks. And then we had Jim Lauderdale. Last night, we had Paul Thorne. So I'm pretty proud of this whole thing, and I'm extra special proud that we've got tonight the holy grail of honky-tonk, Dale Watson! Man, I'm, that's quite a big uh, build-up there, Chris. I don't, know, I, don't know if I, can, I don't know if I can live up to that. Holy grail? Holy hell. So I guess we're, we're live streaming, huh? Which, uh, how many cameras you got? Well, I see one, three. Thank you, thank you, Goldie. Thank you. One. I, oh, I can I can mug it. I'm trying trying to see where I need to mug. You know. <laughs> yeah. Thank you all for coming. Uh, it's the first time I played uh, this place. Uh, uh, Christopher is an old friend of mine, and thank you for booking me, Christopher. <laughs> Food looks great. I got a lot of old friends here, and some friends that are old. Dustin, pardon me while I have a sip of the best beer in the world. Nash Beer Texas. Lone Star. That's right. Now look, I know you can't have one. It's just a prop. Lone Star. Ah, look at that there, man. That's, I got it. Okay. I've uh, I've posted that uh, this thing is something I don't normally do, right? Boy, that is something I don't normally do. It's like wrestling on a bear. But, uh, I can't promise there won't be bloodshed. Good morning, fella. You don't look too good today, thank you. Your eyes are red, your skin is pale. You look like you could use a shade. You had a good time last night. Look at the price you had to pay. Yeah, you'd think that you'd know better than to still be carrying on. Look at the gray sticking out of your head. Now you think you can take a hint, because there's a reason Mother Nature puts it there. While you're out to make more wrinkles, your family's making more memories every day. Yeah, you think that you'd know better than to still be carrying on this way. Crashing in the 40, might better think about going up. You got a wife, a kid to lean on you. Are you strong enough? Get down off your high horse, ain't nobody listening what you say. Yeah, you think that you'd know better than still be carrying on this way. Now I rent 
bites off the toothbrush, put the lid back on the toothpaste too. Then I look up in the mirror just to get me one more good look at you. Man, you can't be as dumb as you look. It ain't too late to make a change. Boy, you think that you'd know better than to still be carrying on this way. Crashing in the 40, might better think about growing up. Got a wife and kid to lean on you. Are you strong enough? Get down off your high horse, ain't nobody listen what you say. Yeah, you think you'd know better than to still be carrying on this way. Yeah, you think that you'd know better than to still be carrying on this way. Thank you. Thank you a whole lot. Lot well. That was the only song I'd had planned the entire night. <laughs> I don't go by a set list. I'm always surprised when I get beyond that one song. Cause, but uh, so if y'all got a, uh, I know that m most uh, most of these acoustic type shows, they tell you, shh, turn your cell phones off and blah blah blah. blah. Yeah, uh, I don't care. <laughs> so, but it, but yeah, if you had a song, you, a certain song you, you came here to hear, you lie when you drink. All right. Flowers in your hair. That was uh, David, Buck David Bucks Kemper. <laughs> I can do Don't Be Angry. Yeah. Hold all right. Hold on now. <laughs> we must we must leave time for my drinking. Just, uh, just, uh, I feel like I'm bragging because you can't get this. The National Beer of Texas. Lone Star. The only beer you should be drinking. Whitens your teeth. Uh, they don't sell it here? Well, that's just a shame. I, don't know. I couldn't live like that. But uh, uh, I do tell you, uh, how many people have watched the live stream we do from Hernando's Hideaway during the whole thing? Yeah, well, thank you. Some people have come up and told me about it, but, uh, and I appreciate you. We still, we still actually uh, do it when I'm there. Uh, we do uh, 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 the chicken shit bingo. Do you know what that is? Where you can actually play chicken shit bingo. Yes! This little thing here has gotten me through the pandemic because, uh, you know, we didn't have an audience. You know, we had we, we played and there was nobody out there, and I just, uh, uh, you know, being the musician who's an egomaniac anyway, and like I needed, I needed uh, affirmation, you know. So and, and even doing this acoustic tour, uh, I also need in case you don't like what I'm doing, I I had a backup plan. Thank you. Thank you. But to be fair, you know, I am fair. I'm a Libra, so I got to balance things. I am fair. When I make mistakes, I, I, I want to be accounted for it. There you go. So I'm prepared. If you don't react the right way, I'm, I got you. No. Yes. Right. Okay. So uh, somebody asked for uh, David Bucks Kemper. Why not? Let's just go right there. <laughs> Uh, anybody know, anybody friends with David Bucks Kemper on Facebook? David, you might be watching. There you go. We had, we had a, we got a farmer out there. He's a dairy farmer. Where you at, Frank? There. All right. He's there with his 15-year-old son, who's, uh, who, uh, uh, is Teo, right, Teo? Is that right? Say yes, Teo. I can't see you. Yes. Teo's learning to play guitar. He's got a. He's uh, He's getting the credit at his uh, guitar lesson for coming to see an acoustic show. How about that? Big hand for Teo there. Yes. <laughs> so Teo, this song is about a farmer who is also a trucker. He's only a trucker two times a year during harvest. 
Yes, mm -hmm. and you can, uh, you can actually friend, right now you get on your phone and friend David Buckskemper. I don't think there's a lot of people named David Buckskemper out there, so you probably get the right one. Uh, Yano Estacado. Anybody ever been to Yano Estacado? Nobody. Oh, one person. Has anybody ever been to Lubbock, Texas? Well, then you've been to Yano Estacado. Hey, hey. Nancy, how you doing, baby? Good to see you. I don't drink normally. So yeah, if you've been <laughs> if you've been to Lubbock, Texas, you've been to Yano Estacado. And uh, David Buck Skimper, he uh, twice a year he takes his uh, whatever he harvests. Uh, and uh, he does it in a truck that has no DOT numbers, doesn't have a license plate, doesn't have nothing. So he's a bit of an outlaw trucker two times a year. But he's only going 15 miles each way. He just takes a chance and does it. So, uh, but here's to all the farmers taking a chance. Thank you, Frank. Thank you, David Buckskipper. <laughs> Thank you, Nancy. All right, true story. David Bucks Kemper from Yano West Dakota. He's got 3,700 acres outside of Lubbock. He's a harvest time trucker hauling wheat and corn and sorghum. That's David Bucks Kemper from Yano West Dakota. He's a trucking farmer, or he's a farming trucker. It all depends on the time of year. Cause in the summer there's a wheat in the fall, corn and sorghum. But David Bucks Kemper from Yano is to call. He's got a cab over Pete to help him with his load. It's a 30 mile round trip, still the DEOT, he got to dodge him. That's David Bucks Kemper from Yano, Mr. Cuddle. Now he's a trucking farmer, or he's a farming trucker. And it all depends on the time of year. Cause in the summer there's a wheat In the fall, corn and sorghum For David Bucks Cooper from Yano West to Cuddle That's David Bucks Kemper from Yano West to Cuddle That's David Bucks Kemper from Yano West to Cuddle Yano West to Cuddle Sounds romantic, doesn't it? It ain't. It's always dusty. It's always windy. Most of all, you ever been out that way in Texas? It's flat. It is so flat. Thanks for asking. It's so flat that uh, you can look in any direction see for a hundred miles but if you stand on a dime you can see for 200 miles that's pretty damn flat it's so flat I, a few months ago I seen David Bucks Kemper he was kind of sad that night we were playing Lubbock I thought why is so sad Dave he says well my dog ran out my back door ran out in the field and Kept running, never came back. I said, man, your dog ran away? Yep. Just ran right out the back door and ran out the field. Never turned around. I seen him about two months later. Still kind of blue. I said, about your dog? I said, yeah. Because every time I go out my back door, I can still see him running away. It's 
pretty flat. That's David Bucks Kemper from that old rest of God. Thank you for asking that, eh? I better get this gum out of my mouth or I'll end up uh, choking to death. Put it right there. Uh, Nancy, thank you for the tequila. Again, I don't drink normally, folks. Did anybody hear me ask for tequila? Anybody? No. Anybody? No. I've never, I mean, I drank a lot of tequila, and I've never asked for one tequila. Not even two. <laughs> I've asked for three. No, I, I, had, I don't have to because uh, Lone Star Beer attracts tequila. See that? Look at that. It's like right to it. That's a good wingman, I'm telling you right now. So, uh, fly on your hair. Who asked for that? Somebody asked to fly on your hair. All right, here we go. Again, I don't go by set list because uh, I got ADD. What? I want to apologize. Goldie, man, thank you so much for, uh, uh, she's making all this sound way better than I am. Uh, by the way, uh, Teo, uh, on this acoustic thing, just just don't do what I do and do the opposite of what I do on this guitar. You'll be all right. Flower on your hair. Like that flower in your hair I like the dresses that you wear I like knowing how we care About this feeling that we share I like how you walk in a room I like the smell of your perfume What I like most about you how you love me like you do And I wouldn't change a thing About the way you think You think I hung the moon I'll never tell you it ain't true I like that flower in your hair I like the dresses that you wear I like most about you is how you love me like you do. And I wouldn't change a thing about the way you Oh, you think I hung the moon I'll never tell you it ain't true I like that flower in your hair I like the dresses that you wear What I like most about you Is how you love me like you do What I like most about you Is how you love me like you do Thank you Thank you for asking that There's not a lot of songs I, I write that aren't about drinking and uh, for the uh, for the youngins in the audience uh, like uh, Teo and and uh, and uh, I was going to say Noah, but I already see. You know, tell you Noah. Noah is a good example. Uh, he's with the Sea Monks, a great band, right out of here. And uh, and Noah, uh, he's one of them. He's one of them. Uh, uh, I tried to be let him know that I'm a bad influence, but he didn't listen. He took off that six string devil. Tail. Noah, Noah, where are you at? Stand up, Noah. Thank you. <laughs> Damn kid, he keeps standing up. He didn't used to be that tall. See what happens to you? Uh, thanks, Norm. I'm glad you're here, man. But anyway, so uh, uh, I write all these drinking songs, and I, I just want to tell you, uh, drinking's bad, okay? <laughs> I 
It looks fun, but call me about 7 o'clock in the morning, I guess. <laughs> Somebody over here wanted to lie when I drank. I'll I don't, I go ahead and do it right now. Hey, I lie. When, you, are you ready for it? Yeah. I, don't know, I don't know. It might be too early. Are you ready for yes. it? Yes. Oh, I lie when I drink, and I drink a lot. Don't believe me when I had a few. Oh, I lie when I drink, and I drink a lot. I only drink when I'm missing you. I walk in the bartender. His eyes. At the same time, the waitress, she just smiles. He's heard the truth about you. She's heard it too, but slightly skewed. I lie, I broke your heart in two. Cause I lie when I drink, and I drink a lot. Don't believe me when I had a view. Yeah, I lie when I drink, and I drink a lot. I only drink when I'm missing you. I surprised myself on that. There's always one. Closing time, I'm the last one out the door. I tip that waitress, that bartender. I ignore. Don't ignore your bartender. Bad idea. Don't do that. I yell, I'm never coming back. That always makes them laugh They know me I won't keep my word Cause I lie when I drink Help me sing it And I drink a lot Don't believe me When I've had a few Everybody get loud, come on I lie when I drink Everybody, everybody I drink a lot I only drink when I'm missing you. I only drink when I'm missing you. Thank you. I will tell you this. I will tell you this. Star. National Beer, Texas. The only beer you should be drinking. Lone Star. Why your teeth? It creates brain cells. It eats calories. That comes in handy for the holidays. Right? It does. It comes in handy for the holidays. But it's the only beer served in heaven. Thank you, Jesus. I ain't lying. All right, I guess I'm doing my, my friend Dustin down here. I've known him a long time, and I can't believe uh, he's still alive. <laughs> you, you know this guy? I mean, it's just amazing that the guy's still alive. He wants to, he wants to hear a song. Uh, I recorded this song, uh, but it was a... Matter of fact, I'm going to buy somebody uh, a drink. If you can tell me, don't Google it. No Googling. Uh, you can't, don't don't uh, uh, duck, duck, go it. Don't Yahoo it. Don't don't ask Jeeves. <laughs> you gotta be isn't that funny? You gotta be a certain age to even know that. Ask Jeeves. It's crazy. <laughs> I 
Hey, Noah, did you ever ask Jeeves anything? No. He don't even know what I'm talking about. So, yeah, uh, who, had the, uh, who, was a, who had the hit on Don't Be Angry? Anybody know? Anyone? Anyone? Yell it. Got to know it right now. Who? Wrong. No. June Carter. No. No. It was, uh, uh, no, nobody knows. I mean, it's, 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 it's uh, Crystal Gale. That's a, that was a good guess. No, it's wrong. Stonewall Jackson. Somebody Googled. Did you Google? You be honest with me. Absolutely. Don't be angry with me, darling, if I fail to understand. All your little whims and wishes all the time Just remember, I'm gonna do my guess Again, a foolish man And my head stays sort of foggy Cause you're mine Remember the first time I flirted with you, girl and I jokingly said, come and be my bride. Now time has turned the pages. It's the sweetest joke on earth. Just to wake up every morning by your side. So don't be angry when me, darling, if I fail to understand. All oh, your little whims, your little whims, your little wishes All the time Just remember I'm gonna do my guess Like any foolish man And my head stays sort of foggy Cause you're mine Maybe someday, you're gonna hurt me. I've been hurt by love before. Only God can know, and time alone will tell. In the meantime, I'm gonna love you with all my heart and soul. Maybe God can last if it's His will. So don't be angry with me, darling, if I fail to understand all your little whims, your little whims, your little wishes all the time. Just remember, I'm going to do my guess like any foolish man, and my head stays sort of foggy because you're mine. Yes, my head stays sort of foggy Cause you're mine I haven't done that in a long time Thank you Okay There you go, so you get loud, proud, holler out songs uh, I'm going to tell my, my, my better half over there She's got about, I'm going to do about two songs Call her up uh, Celine Lee. Celine Lee is with me. And uh, uh, I might as well. Why not? All right, fine, I'll do that. Hey, Dale, hey. Is that right? It's Heather's birthday. Well, that's a horse of a different color, Heather. <laughs> Okay. 
<laughs> Y'all are way too excited for no reason. I don't know what the hell you're, the hell you're talking about. One of my favorite scenes in an uh, 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 Elvis movie was, uh, uh, what was it, uh, Joe House Rock, right? I think it was Joe House Rock. There was this uh, really uh, high pollutant. He went to a party, got drugged to a party, and uh, or, or, or he was having a party somewhere. And, and uh, this lady was talking about this painting and how this was a great painting because it had uh, something about the artist was saying this, this and this and that. And Elvis turns to the lady and goes, Lady, I don't know what the hell you're talking about. <laughs> I don't know, I just I always, that's uh, the thing I say. Heather, happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Y'all can sing along, come on. Happy birthday, dear Heather. Act like you know her. Happy birthday to you. She's rich. Happy birthday, honey. So you want to hear about Billy Joe Shaver, right? All right. Everybody know who Billy Joe Shaver is, right? Well, he was a, he was a dear friend and, and a lovely guy. I miss him. I wrote this song about what happened to him in, uh, outside of Waco, Texas. Uh, he's the only guy I know that got in a knife fight. Well, the only guy I know that got in a knife fight and brought a gun. That's... He won. So I wrote this song about uh, what they said happened. And, uh, and I thought it was all right song, but I called Billy because I thought maybe I ought to get the facts straight from, from Billy instead of uh, the TV, you know. So I called Billy and I said, hey, Billy, I wrote this song. He says, you did? You like it? I go, yeah, I like it all right. He's, he said... I said, it's, it's called Where Do You Want It? He goes, oh, that's bad. He says, so Dale, look, uh, I can't talk about what happened. I go, all right, well, hey, look, you know what? I just, uh, I just won't, I just throw the song away. I just, it was just something I was inspired to do. And, you know, he goes, no, 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 look here. You got to keep doing that song, man. I mean, it says, uh, you know, it's a, you know, songs are like your children, you know? You know, you, you bring them to life, and they're just kind of a thing that, that you do, you know. It takes energy and love and all that stuff to make a song. He says, but what a lot of people don't accept, don't know, is that it's a fact of life. Some people have ugly children. <laughs> I often look at my mama when I say that. Look right at her, mama. But he said, and what you do with it, you, you got yourself an ugly youngin right there. And I'd appreciate it if you keep that shut in for a while till the trial's over. And I said, all right, Billy, I'll do that. But it was too late, because apparently I already did it at Chicken Shit Bingo, and word got around. So during the trial, they said, Mr. Shaver, you said, where do you want it? He goes, no, I didn't. He said, yes, you did. There's a song about it. He says, what? Del Watson's got a song called, where do you want it? Where you said that. So they had to call uh, Willie Nelson and Kinky Friedman up to the stand <laughs> to verify that I'm an idiot. I don't know what I'm talking about. I wasn't there. And if they could have called me, I would have said, yeah, I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm just going by what the TV said. I don't know. I could, I could prove I don't know nothing most of the time. So luckily, he got acquitted, as he should have. Because, ladies and gentlemen, this is a, just a song. It's a song I wrote, I made up in my head, by the stories I heard on TV. So it's a fictional tale that really happened. <laughs> South of Wiggle, at a place called Papa Joe's, I heard the say so, about a man named Billy Joe. Got in a tank, fell a poor tonight, Billy pulled his gun. Like the kind of law he is, Billy asked him, son, where do you want it? Point to where you want to feel some pain, cause I'm a goner. 
give it my best name. I warned you, leave me alone. Now I'm asking, where do you want it? That's right. Now Billy's reputation it's the kind of guy that wouldn't hurt a fly, but with provocation, you know, it hit on Billy's wilder side. Billy had the nerve. Yep. That boy jumped right on it. Billy asked him, where do you want it? Where do you want it? Point the way where it feels the pain, because I'm a gonna give it my best day. I warned you, leave me alone. Now I'm asking. Where do you want it? Hey, Billy, ask him, where do you want it? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Happy birthday, Heather. So uh, uh, I have a bar in, uh, in uh, Memphis, Tennessee. It's called Hernando's Hideaway. Yes. Yes, thank you, Frank. And uh, during the uh, during the the pandemic, uh, uh, I'm, I was really glad it was there. Thank you. It was my outlet, so to speak, uh, for uh, making any kind of living. And uh, so I, uh, now now it's not in the way that now I'm able to get out and do. Boy, that looks good. You gonna eat all that, Heather? That's really, that's a, yeah. That looks really good. That smells so good from here. I'm glad y'all put it right here. Did y'all order, y'all got, y'all eating something too? Everybody here is eating something. That's good. I'll eat tomorrow. I'm all right. So, if you ever get out to Memphis, I hope y'all can make it out to the hideaway. Well, I'm headed to the hideaway. It's where I go each day Kick up my heels When the sun goes down Yeah, the good times are better there So grab a stool, a chair The land's old school with no food Beer drinking, shot shoot Roadhouse honky-tonk lounge When you walk through the swinging doors Feels like a hug. The band will get you on the dance floor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It'll make you wanna cut her rug, hook, hook. Now it's a hush, hush kind of place. On the south side of town. Last old school and no food. Beer drinking, shot shoot. Roadhouse, honky tonk lounge. That's right. down Memphis way and you make it out to the hideaway we only got one rule just one rule no bad times allowed when you walk into that place we want to put a lone star beer in your face I mean a smile on your face last old school no fooling beer drinking shot shoot roadhouse honky tonk lounge when you walk through the swinging doors, it feels like a hug. The band will get you on the dance floor. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll make you wanna cut a rug, hook, hook. Now it's a hush, hush kind of place. On the south side of town, the last old school, no food, beer drinking, shot shoot, roadhouse, honky tonk lounge. The last old school of no fooling, beer drinking, shot shooting, roadhouse, honky tonk lounge. Come to Memphis, come see us. Thank you.
man, Heather, you got to smack your food that loud? What's going on? That, does that happen when you get older? Is that Dustin? Oh, merciful. Dustin's sleeping on the couch tonight. Speaking of sleeping on the couch, <laughs> I've been there before. How about my better half? You ready to get up here and do a couple of songs? Hey, John, Miss Celine Lee. Gonna tease it, to tease it some. She's gonna tease it, to tease it some. Oh. All the way from the bar. Hello, everyone. How are you? We have not been back here since I think it was original mics a couple few years ago, right? And then before that, it was um, it was a tiki bar. The tiki don't bar. Don't look at me. I, I don't remember nothing. Don the beachcomber. Yes. Uh, Rest in peace. The reason I don't remember nothing because they took me over to Turks afterwards. It kind of raced my memory all that stuff. Well, you remember See, that. See, tail. Don't do as I do, Tao. Let's do our Johnny and June song. Really? Yeah. What do y'all think? Yeah? <clears throat> I was gargling tequila to get my vocals warmed up. See? My kind of woman. <laughs> we wrote this via text, and it's on my uh, Call Me Lucky album. Do I have that album here? You do not. I do not have that album here. But you can get it online. Or stream it. Like that sparrow, Miss Flag. Like the moon would miss night. Like a flower, Miss Blue. That's how I'd miss you. Like a mother would miss her baby. Like a cowboy miss his lady Like the sky would miss blue That's, That's how, how I'd, I'd miss you. you You're the cream in my coffee You're the yes to my maybe You're the wind in my sail a lullaby to my baby Like a song would miss music Like a singer would miss song Like Johnny miss June That's how I miss you You're the cream in my coffee. You're the grits in my gravy. You're the wind in my sail. A lullaby to my baby. Like a song would miss music. Like a singer would miss song. Like Johnny Miss June That's how I'd miss you Like a bell would miss ringing Like a bird would miss singing Like Johnny Miss June That's how I'd miss you like Johnny missed you That's how I'd miss you Thank you so much.
my job. What should we do? Honey, why do you do this Do it off your record. Went off your we, don't we don't rehearse either. We just argue before about songs before on stage in front of everyone. <laughs> I could have sworn somebody bought me a tequila so I can go. Isn't that right? It's well, not, you know, know, people asked asked if they could buy shots online. Oh, that's a great idea. Absolutely. Oh, were you monitoring the comments? I was, yes. I think. I... Yeah. We got comments. All right. Yeah. And Nancy just asked me if I wanted a shot. Oh, Nancy, Nancy, thank you, baby. I appreciate that very much. Yeah, we've been on uh, the road and stuck in traffic. I've been for celebrating two days. James Enfield's birthday for the last week. <laughs> and yeah. And uh, hopefully he's going to be here tomorrow That's and hang out said. with us. Yeah. Sing with us, but but uh, again, I don't drink normally, and I just want to tell you, I'd like to thank all the little people for that award. <laughs> what are you doing? What are Please you song. doing? Do something off your record, baby. It's weird without the band, so uh, let's do a Sayonara Sucker or Cat Fight. Which one? <laughs> So racist, and I'd like to apologize. Uh, He's not. That night he was feeling rocky. He warmed up a last jug of sake, drinking like a love sick kamikaze. The next morning he was feeling kind of fuzzy. Pounded in his head what it meant when he woke. Sayonara, suckers, all she wrote. Sayonara, suckers, all she wrote. Didn't even write a hex oh. Harry carried on love. What's your name, huh? What's your name? Nancy. What, what is your name? Cassidy. Cassidy. Thank you, Cassidy. You're one of, do you know what the other service names are? We'll find out. Andrea. Grant. 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 Noah. Noah. Anna. Anna. Joseph. Joseph. We have our bartenders, Jasmine and Linda. Jasmine and Linda behind the bar. Yay. Jennifer. Yay. And Jen. That's a lot of folks, man. He's really good about remembering names. Too. Not now. <laughs> hey, please don't forget your servers and your bartenders. We love y'all so much. You. Thank, Thank you, much. you guys. Hey, Cassidy. I, <laughs> she tried to tell me who bought this certain drink, and uh, I can't see. What's your names? Took a oh, the Kurt, that, Kurt, Kurt from uh, yeah. Kurt gave me a big compliment. He said that uh, uh, he uh, because of my music, he got turned on to people like J.P. Harris and uh, uh, oh, yeah. Derailers and stuff like that. Thank you, man. That's a big compliment, Kurt. Appreciate that. Again, I don't drink normally. All right. Why don't we just do, let's do a, a, a. All right. I'm wearing my Bucky's shirt. I don't know if anyone's been to Bucky's in Texas. Damn. Bucky's is the best. What do you call Bucky's? How do you what do you call Bucky's? It's like the best convenience store department gas station in Texas. Ah, oh, it's amazing. So go to Bucky's if you ever come to Texas. Well Bucky's, they got one in Alabama too, that's yeah, right. They just opened one. Bucky's is the biggest. It's like As our friends from Australia, when they seen Bucky's, they said. What a waste of space. They have a it's million like, gas pumps. They, they have one million gas pumps. Literally. But awesome, awesome shopping. Too. No, that's good. It's good. Yeah. 
Beef jerky. I got every kind of beef jerky you ever. Is this a Bucky's commercial? Sorry, sorry. Well, we got married in a fever. Hotter than a pepper sprout. We've been talking about Jackson ever since the fire went. Mess around. I'm going to Jackson. Look out, Jackson Town. Well, go on down to Jackson. Go ahead and wreck your hell. Go play your hand, you big talking man. Make a big fool of yourself. Yeah, go to Jackson. Go poke on that big old head. <laughs> I'm going to Jackson. See if I can. Now when I breeze into that city, people gonna stoop and bow. Ha! All the women there in Jackson, I'm gonna teach them what they don't know how. I'm going to Jackson. Turn to loose of my landscape coat. Hey, I'm going to Jackson. Goodbye, that's all she wrote. But they'll laugh at you in Jackson. And I'll be dancing on a pony cat. They'll lead you around town like a scalded hound. Your tail took between your legs. Yeah, go to Jackson. Big talking man, and I'll be waiting in Jackson behind my J Pan fan. Oh, oh, we, we got, got married in a fever, hotter than a pepper sprout. We've been talking about Jackson ever since the fire went out. We're going to Jackson, and that's a Going to Jackson, ain't never coming back. Oh, we got married in a fever, hotter than a pepper sprout. We've been talking about Jackson ever since a fire went out. Do I'm gonna be right over there at the merch table. Uh, hey, 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 hey. I'm so glad you asked me that. Oh, here we are. Because I don't drink normal. So glad we got that cord. Best beer in the world, Lone Star. The only beer you should be drinking. Look at here. If you did, life would be much better. You know why? It's the only beer that makes you a better person than you really are. <laughs> right. What is it, Cure? Oh, uh, no, no. Oh, you can't say no. that I'm, I'm no. Alive? Oh, no, I'm just going to tell you. Liquid Viagra. Oh. Lone Star. <laughs> Why? 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 All right, that's all I'm going to say. Anyway. Hey, we're going to go. Let's, let's slow down. Let's do a. Let's do a uh, Meet me, Memphis? Storms, Memphis. Or Storms? Storms? You tell me, baby. Which one you want to do? Um, Memphis. You want to do that? Let's promote Memphis. All right. We wrote this song. Uh, we have an amazing bar there and uh, an amazing life there. So there's a little story about it. We're coming and going, running and throwing away. Our precious time wasting away each God given day to lose it to weary each night, working and worrying, rushing and hurrying just to do it all over again. A better life's waiting, we just have to take it. Let's cast our faith. Meet me in Memphis. 
let's just lay down Bathe in the sunset Of sweet southern sound Lead me in the house Where the rain's even kind Meet me in me Let's start a new life. The first step's the hardest one to take. I'd tell you the story first, but I don't know. I don't know. Rosalie Mapis. Rosalie Mapis. Yes. Right. Rosalie Mapis here in California. I know who she is, right? Yes. Joe Mapis. Rosalie Mapis. Yes. She just passed away, and we were able. She came to the Ameripolitan Awards in 2020. Wait a minute. Before. You gotta talk slower, honey. There's... She came to the Ameripolitan Awards in 2020 before the world shut down, and we were able to sing this song that she wrote with her husband and we're gonna sing it for you right now I'm gonna wear the pants but I'm gonna tell you which pair to wear I'm gonna be the boss you see you just beware you can rattle your chains and put on the dog and act like a millionaire I'm gonna wear the pants but I'll tell you which pair to wear <laughs> don't encourage her We got married a couple of years ago, had a little home for two. The very first day, he started acting like a man and telling me what to do. Man's the king of the house, the big dog I'm going to be. You got to wake up early in the morning to get ahead a little on me. I'm going to wear the pants. I'm going to tell you which pair to wear. I'm going to be the boss, Celine Lee. Just beware. You can rattle your chains and put on the dog and act like a millionaire. But I'm gonna wear the pants. But I'll tell you which pair to wear. Now the man's been the king of the castle ever since the world begun. I ain't gonna be the one to change all that, let me tell you something, hun. As long as I let you think you're the boss, we'll get along just fine. But when you start believing it, that's where I draw the line. No! I'm gonna wear the pants. I'm gonna tell you which pair to wear. I'm gonna be the boss, Celine Lee. <laughs> you just beware. You can rattle your change and put on the dog and act like a millionaire. Well, I'm gonna wear the pants. But I'll tell you which pair to wear. I said I'm gonna wear the pants. But I'll tell you which pair to wear. They're Wrangler jeans, everybody. <laughs> Thank you, very much. Celine Lee, everybody. See you tomorrow. Can I have both of these? I want one. Just one. Yeah, I'll take one. Yeah. All right. One more time, Miss Celine Lee. Put your hands Uh, 
Uh, I hate to uh, waste people's money because I don't drink normally, uh, but also uh, my mama raised me, my mom and dad raised me to, uh, uh, you know, eat everything in front of you and drink everything in front of you. Oh, what'd you just say? Say it again. Say it out loud. Don't do it. Say it louder. Don't do it. She said, don't do it. Don't do it. God. Do it. Oh. Do it. I love you, honey. I'll tell you this. She said, don't do it. Tio, do not pay attention to me. Noah. It's too late for you. Yeah. I feel like I feel like I'm in Back to the Future when I got double dog dared. I hate being told what not to do. I hate it, I hate it. Good God, I hate it. Almost as much as I hate being told what to do. Now I realize that's a character flaw. Maybe some folks are just trying to be nice and help me out. Like that young lady over there. Don't do it. Maybe I shouldn't have done it, but I did it. I did it for spite. Half the shit I do in my life, I do because of spite. I guess that's why I'm here on this earth today and learn about that. Stop it. But I wrote this song out of spite. They say I shouldn't be drinking And I shouldn't be smoking There's a lot of things I'm doing I shouldn't do, it's true. I'm gonna keep on doing all these things I shouldn't do. Yeah, uh-huh. Yeah, that's right. Right? Who hates to be told what to do? No. Say I shouldn't be all that southern fried chicken. There's a lot of things I'm doing I shouldn't do, it's true. I'm gonna keep on doing all these things I shouldn't do. Oh, dum 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 dum. A lot of things I'm doing I shouldn't do. It's true. I'm gonna keep on doing these things I shouldn't do. Uh huh. That's right. I gotta be honest with you. On the way here, I played San Diego last night. On the way here on the six hour trip. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Now I used to live in California and I tell you, somehow that damn five has gotten a lot longer than it used to be. What the hell happened? It's like traveling through time. I mean, <laughs> I look on my GPS and it says, you have 10 miles to go. It'll take you one hour and a half. <laughs> what? <laughs> Jesus. Anyway, so there I was. We're coming back to San Diego. Checked it, you know, stopped and got gas. I went in a... Uh, did an article over there, and I, and I smelled the hot dogs, you know? Hot dogs smell pretty good. Now, a hot dog in a gas station is probably not a good idea, but... You know, I didn't eat breakfast, you know, they walked in there, and I said, mmm, I did it. He told me, don't do it. I did it. I did it because you said, don't do it. So I did it. Yeah, I, ate that. I, got, I bought that hot dog. Guess what I did, though? This is what made it pissed off the cashier. 
I, I put mayonnaise on my hot dog. Oh, no, don't give me that. So, I, that's what he said. He goes, you put mayonnaise on? I said, what? You paying for this or me paying for this? I got back in the car and, and then I, I happened to actually get to the hotel pretty soon after that. Started checking in the hotel and the guy says, hey, we have a uh, heated pool, an indoor heated pool if you'd like. I said, that kind of sounds good right now. I'd like to take a dip. And he seen me eating that hot dog, had a little mayonnaise right there. He goes, kind of looked at that mayonnaise and went like, he said, well, sir, uh, you probably should wait at least 30 minutes before you go swimming. I jumped right in. I didn't even take my clothes off. I said, I don't think so. Where is it? He says, right over there. I said, I jumped right in. Mayonnaise on my cheek and all. I had a little bit of cramp, but I was okay. So I got up to the room. I checked in uh, the room there, and I was, uh, I thought, well, <laughs> my clothes are wet. I better take a shower. So uh, right there, right there. Right next to the hair dryer. Do not use in the bathtub. When I woke up, I tore the tags off all the sheets and the mattresses. Pillowcases, everything, everything. I just got that, it's something about it. I just don't like being told what not to do. Do not. I was doing all right, I thought, but then I come down to the elevator there and Slim was already in the car there and I met this couple. Big, tall, skinny fella. Big, tall, skinny fella. He's probably about, I don't know, 75, 80 years old. Looked like he hated life. His wife was about four foot wide. <laughs> and she asked him right in front of me. I'm sitting there. It's only three of us in the elevator. She goes, honey, does this dress make my ass look fat? <laughs> Noah, Tio, there's only one answer to that. I don't care who you are or who you're talking about, what they look like. What they, the answer is no, okay? Where have you been all my life? What's your name? Jennifer. You're Jennifer. Yes. Where'd that come from? The drink fairy. The drink fairy. That's you? Tequila, whiskey, and beer. All right. Set that down right there, honey. What's your name, man? All right. Thank you, Rob. Thank you, Jennifer. So the end of this story, there I was in the elevator with this big, tall, skinny fella and this short... Nice woman, seemed like a nice, smelled really good, smelled really good. But she asked him the ultimate question, honey, does this dress make my ass look fat? <laughs> I couldn't help it, I go, he could look to me, he looked to me for advice. <laughs> I, <laughs> the elevator door opened up, I said, are you gonna tell her or am I gonna tell her? And he goes, he looked, <laughs> he kind of looked at me. My, I walked away and I just seen in the background like, and she turned to him and hit him. Hey, I shouldn't be so outspoken. I put it all out in the open. There's a lot of things I'm doing I shouldn't do, it's true. I'm gonna keep on doing all these things I shouldn't do. Oh, dumb, 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 dumb. A lot of things I'm doing I shouldn't do. It's true. Gonna keep on doing all these things I shouldn't do.
You are too nice. That was a true story, though. Uh, well, all except for the mayonnaise on my cheek. I made that up. Just, uh, I don't made that for real. Hey, folks, uh, uh, I got this request here, uh, and, you, and you don't think it's a request, but it, it really is. It's a request in the form of liquid, which is pretty brilliant. Your name's Rob. I can't see your face. Uh, you know, I think it's always... Uh, I wish people would were, were named... Uh, when they get named, they, 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 uh, it would fit their the life choice. Hey, Rob, you should be a bank robber. You should be... Or, or, or a politician. Rob. You work on, you're, are you on the city council? Okay. You know... Uh, uh, Bob should be a lifeguard. Oh, okay. uh, all right. Never mind. I, I just kind of went off on a tangent. But, but he, he, he actually sent up uh, a tequila, a whiskey, and a beer. Damn. No, you're wrong. Who said that? Who said about George Thorogood? I, I apologize. I want you to apologize to everybody right here. That's right. Actually, that was one shot, one bourbon, one beer. And it wasn't George Thorogood. It was somebody else for that. But that's, you need to tell us, man. That's wrong. So tequila, whiskey, and beer. Don't look at me, Teo. I wrote this song. <laughs> when I wrote this song, I was in Chicago and uh, inspired. What, what, was, what bar was it? What bar was it, honey? It's before I met you, but you know the story. <laughs> Martyrs. Martyrs, yeah. It was Martyrs. And they were feeding me uh, a lot of drinks that night. More than you are feeding me. <laughs> by the way. And so uh, I was having a little too much fun. And uh, I was inspired to write this song. So the next time I was going to do an album, I told the record company, hey, I, I want to record that song I wrote. They said, uh... Dale, you can't even play this song. How are you going to do it? So, no. I said, they said, Dale, you can't do that song. What do you mean? I, why can't I do it? He said, it's, we don't own the copyright to that song. I said, I wrote this song. They said, we're not going to let you do it. I said, all right. So... On the album, uh, what, al what album was it, honey? It was uh, Carrying On. Carrying On was a CD that came out on. Carrying On. But if you get the American version of Carrying On, it's not on there. Because they said, we can't do it. Uh, they will sue us if we do this, if you do that song. So I said, all right. So I didn't do it on that album. What happened, if you know about uh, territories, uh, 
I own all the albums I do. So I, I went to Europe. I said, you got a problem with putting this out? They said, okay. I don't know how you say K in Dutch. I don't know. So anyway, they put it out. Actually, the record company here put it out too, but they got sued. I'm just joking. They didn't put it out. But it's so if you want to hear the song, it's only on the European version of Carrying On. I wrote this song. Damn it. If I only had a brain to get back my stolen heart, I have the courage it takes to leave this bar. Boom, boom, boom. It's the yellow brick road. All the yellow brick road keeps winding along. All the yellow brick road your journey to the honky tonk wizard of Oz. That's right. There's the kilo of whiskey and beer. Oh my, kilo of whiskey and beer. Oh my, yeah, it was scary. I drank it all night. Kilo of whiskey and beer. Oh my, kilo of whiskey and beer. Kilo of whiskey and beer. One on the left, two on the right. Kilo of whiskey and beer. Pay no attention to the man behind the bar. He's a wizard of booze and can grant you what you want. Boom, 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 boom. Yes, you'll be mesmerized. We're off to see the wizard. Likely it's not a wonderful wizard of Oz. Your journey to the honky tonk wizard of Oz. Well, look out! There's tequila, whiskey, and beer. Tequila, whiskey, and beer. Yeah, it was scary. I drank it all night. The kilo of whiskey and beer. Kilo of whiskey and beer. The kilo of whiskey and beer. One on the left, two on the right. The kilo of whiskey and beer. Now this part. <coughs> now this was before uh, there was much more than uh, AOL. I didn't know. I just I, this part in the movie. I I kind of stole from. They, uh, I wanted to know what the, they were saying, the little munchkins, you know? And uh, if you, the, Google didn't exist back then. I had to Yahoo it, I had to AOL it, I had to ask Jeeves. What else, I had to, what was, what was the other one? Botanica, that's right. I, there was another one, though, that was popular, it kind of went away, what was it? It's a, a search engine. Bing, I binged it. Yes, I did. I binged it. But they came back with a, a couple of different things. What did the munchkins say in there that? What do you think they're saying? What are they saying? Anybody know? Is that what they're saying? They're not saying anything? They're just saying, oh, we Yeah. No. Wrong. <laughs> no. They're actually saying something. And then if you bing it and ask Jeeves, apparently they're saying a few things. We all owe the old one, or we all love the old one. I didn't like any one of them. So my version, I said, all we own, we owe on. Fit me. All we own, we owe on. All we own, we owe on. I'm seeing monkeys flying. Ain't in Kansas anymore. And I click my heels. Time to head on home. But home ain't the same. It's changed from what it was. So I storm back to my honky tonk wizard of us. Look out! There's tequila, whiskey, and beer. Tequila, whiskey, and beer. 
tequila, whiskey, and beer. Tequila, whiskey, and beer. One on the left, two on the right. Tequila, whiskey, and beer. There you go, Rob. That's my friend Rob, the politician. What kind of whiskey did you give me, Rob? You just ordered whiskey. All right. You're a man of discriminating taste, Rob. Thanks, Rob. <laughs> Look at Heather going, drink it. It's your birthday, Heather. I'm going to drink it for you, honey. Dang it. Somebody double dared me. You know we're live on the internet right now, don't you? We're, we're... What camera are we on? What... That one right there. I see it. Look at you. Hey, thanks a lot, everybody, for coming out. Uh, I, I, actually, I was going to do South of Round Rock, but I, I want to make sure that I got the requests that came in earlier. Uh, truck Stop LaGrange, okay. Let me ask you this, though. How many people are going to be here? How many people have tickets for tomorrow? Anybody? Really? I'm going to have a full band here tomorrow. I got uh, Lauren Raw on upright bass. Uh, Lauren Raw was, uh, was, in, was in my band uh, exactly 100 years ago from the night. Uh, he joined my band. <laughs> he played in Bellflower by, with me at the Blue Bayou. Played all over him. And uh, Doug Livingston, Ernest Bovine on the pedal steel guitar. Gonna be right there. Sean's gonna be on the drums in the back. It's gonna be, uh, well, I don't know if we can two step or not. We're gonna be able to dance. Well, hell, you can dance right now. Ain't nothing stopping you. What's that, baby? James told me it will come out. Uh, I'm not going to hold him to it. It's a seven-hour drive from, from L.A. to here. <laughs> so, <laughs> shit. <laughs> People on the Internet going, hmm, it doesn't, look, look, doesn't look that far. <laughs> oh, you want South of Round Rock. There's something going down in the little town South of Round Rock, Texas They greet you with a smile like it's going out of style South of Round Rock, Texas They do the two-step Every song is played You can keep your new step And I get their own way Country music, it's alive Kicking right here tonight South of Round Rock, Texas. Somebody give me a Bob Wills holler. Here. Now, if you ever go there, you're gonna want to stay. If you ever leave it, you'll be back again one day. There's something about these parts. Live inside your heart South of Round Rock, Texas Go to game, boy Now if you ever go there You're gonna wanna stay If you ever leave it You'll be back again one day there's something about these parts Live inside your heart South of Round Rock South of Round Rock Just south of Round Rock, Texas Woo. 
There's always somebody from the internet that's going to criticize the swing. Uh -huh. uh, I'm going to do one, uh, one more. I'm you, paying attention to the time there, which I don't normally. Because... Uh, I got you. I got you. I got you. I'm going to answer that after I do this last slow song. I do this for the dancers out there. Look, we're on the internet. They don't know I'm lying. Don't give it away. We got somewhere, folks on the internet, you don't know this, but we got somewhere under a thousand people here tonight. Right? Can you hell yeah? Somewhere under a thousand people here, and, and we got we got folks don't know that Campus Jacks has 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 a, a dance floor that can accommodate somewhere under a thousand dancers. Somewhere. So this is, this is not the last song, but it is the last slow song. And uh, I will tell you this: if uh, if you if you dance to this song, uh, there's a 99.9% .9 chance you will become pregnant. Even if you're a man. <laughs> Maybe in California, especially if you're a man. I don't, I don't, I don't know. I don't know. Look, I don't know. I don't, I don't know. I, Dustin, you look kind of pregnant. I don't know. <laughs> you're just, you're, he said, he, I'm just full. <laughs> Actually, you're, okay. Yeah, well, thank you, y'all. I have this record on sale out there. Uh, uh, it's, it's on the flip side of the Elvis Was a Love Affair. It's called You'll Cry Too. Your heart beats in time. I'm leaving it around. Your heart beats in time with mine, and you'll find. When you leave me behind, you'll cry too. You'll cry too. Like I do when you leave a love so. Scars, it starts in your heart, but till you reach that part, you'll cry to you. Thank you. Well, oh, I forgot to do a happy birthday. I forgot about it. I got it right here in my happy birthday, Richard. Dang it. Are y'all even still here? Uh, dang it. You know, I had it right here in my pocket this whole time. I know. 
Now, what's a little confusing? It looks like a. Uh, a <laughs> Maybe because I've been drinking a little bit. <laughs> Internet. Headshot. In your face, sucker. Uh, Richard, it looks like to me, Richard want to Marsha ja Mary Jane. No, Richard, where's Richard? Rich, Richard wanna. I feel like this is a joke. Richard wants some Mary Jane. I. Wait, look, I'm not. All right, let me. All right, let me. Let me all right, let me go ahead and do it phonetically. Richard Wana, are you out there? Oh, there are four different people. Oh, you got to admit that's pretty damn coincidental. Richard Wana, Marsha. Mar no, I'm sorry, not Mary. Marsha, Jane. Oh, yeah. Don't give a man that drinks this list. Richard, Juana, Marsha, Jane. It still sounds like Richard wants some pot. <laughs> where are you at, Richard? It's your birthday. Birthday man, Richard. All right. Where are you at, Juana? And where's Marsha? Marsha, 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 and Jane. So they're all high right there. Them four people who are high as a kite. Happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, happy birthday Richard Wanna, Marsha, Jane, want some Mary Jane, stop getting high on my, oh you got a cake and everything, look they got a, they got a CBD cake and everything, good God how old are they, <laughs> folks on the internet, 911, please. We got a. Oh, no, no, we're okay. We're okay. We're all right. We're good. Holy Jesus, that's a bonfire over there. Happy birthday to you, Richard, Marsha, Mary Jane. Richard, wanna. Please blow that out. Please, can it. Do we. Do we need to call the, the Costa Mesa Fire Department? I don't know. No, I didn't. Really? Okay, happy birthday. Crazy arms on the road in San Antonio Rose for Richard, Marsha, Jane, and Juana. That's a totally different order. I'm not even joking here, man. I'm, I'm not joking here. I like, I like it better the other way around. Richard, Juana, and Mary Jane. All right. Well, I, I, look here, I, I, was, I was almost time, I mean, it's past time to go. I mean, uh, I, should, I should be. Hey, the, no, yeah, the, screw, screw the encore. Let's just go ahead and, you know, I, I, encores are ridiculous. I, I'd, I'd rather just keep picking. So, right, can I get a hell yeah? In your face, sucker. All right, Richard, Marsha, Jane, Juana, or Richard, Juana, Mary, Jane. And I blew ain't the word for the way that I feel has gone ruin in this heart of mine. This ain't no crazy dream, I know. What are you doing? You got a pee? <laughs> really? That's real. Here's someone else's love now. You're not my two two women go in pairs. What is it? What is that? You don't see two guys go to the bathroom at the same time. Great. Y'all want to go too? Two guys. Crazy eyes that reach to hold somebody new. Why my yearning heart keeps saying you're not mine. My double run go soon to another you'll be with And that's why I'm lonely all the time So take all the treasured dreams I have for you and me And take all the love I thought was mine 
someday my crazy arms will hold somebody new. Till then I'll be lonely all the time. Crazy arms that reach to hold somebody new. While my yearning heart keeps saying you're not mine. My troubled mind will soon to another you'll be with And that's why I'm lonely all the time On the road again Just can't wait to get on that road again Life I love is making music with my friends I can't wait to get on the road again on the road again Going places that I've never been Seeing things that I may never see again I can't wait to get on the road again On the road again Like a band of gypsies we keep going our way We're the best of friends Insisting that the world keep going our way And our way is on the road again just can't wait to get on the road again. Writing music, my friends. I can't wait to get on the road again. On the road again. That's pretty good. Come on. All right. I mean, I, I, I drink, I drink, I drink a bit. I mean, I just, I'll do it again. That's a three. I admit that was sloppy. On the road again, since the world is going our way, we're the best of friends. Insisting that the world keep going our way And our way On the road again Just can't wait to get on the road again Life I love is making music for my friends I can't wait to get on the road again I can't wait to get on the road again That's right Hey, I did good on that one. I did, I mean, uh, relatively. Uh, I, you know, look, I can't do the last one uh, on the cause we're, nah, hell, I'll do it for you. <laughs> Deep within my heart, but melody, a song of poor San Antonio. I'm going to do it in a different key. Deep within my heart lies a melody, a song of old San Antonio, where in dreams I live with a memory beneath the stars all alone. It was there I found on the Alamo, enchantment strange as a moon up above. That moonlit path that only she would know The rose, my rose, San Antonio Moon in all your splendor, no only my heart Speak once again of my, oh my Lips so sweet and tender, like petals falling apart Speak once again of my love, my oh Empty songs I know Live in my heart alone Oh, that moonlit path Behind the Alamo And rose by rose of San Antonio By rose, rose of San Antonio <laughs> Lips so sweet and tender Stop it, stop it. We got
Every time I do a Western Swing song, I get that right, from the internet. Folks, this is not our last song, uh, it's, but it's uh, the last song I'm doing tonight. I know. I know. I, I, I can't believe it either. I can't believe it either. National Beer of Texas, the only beer you should be drinking. Lone Star. It's the only beer that uh, actually, uh, it, it, right here in that small print, every day. Look, if you drink a Lone Star beer one a day, just one a day, every day, without missing a day, how about that? One a day without missing a day, you will never die. One a day without missing a day, you'll never die. I gotta be honest with you, that was uh, such a great, you know, money back guarantee you too, you get all the money back. I gotta be honest with you, after uh, this year and the, and, the, and the 2020, I skipped a day just on purpose. Hell yeah, I did. Okay, I won't do it. I just thought about it. Somebody asked for this song. Uh, this man just asked me, what is a kolache? How many people know what a kolache is? Well, well, well. Kolache is a German Czech pastry. That's right. Damn good. Now, the proper term of kolache is it's got it has some uh, strawberry, lemon, maybe apricot. Uh, some what's that other thing that's it, it tests positive for, it makes you think you, you, you did pot. What's that other thing? Poppy seed, poppy seed. Uh, how, many, how many people say, poppy seed? Poppy seed. That's what I told them. I told them it was poppy seed. So, yeah. But... It's a generic form, just like you say, I want a Coke, and they say, what kind of Coke? Dr. Pepper. <laughs> it's kind of like that. When you say you want a kolache, they say, what kind of kolache? I say, uh, jalapeno sausage. <laughs> it don't make no sense in the real world, but it, in Texas, it makes sense. So, so yeah, I want a jalapeno sausage with cheese. And so that's what a kolache is. Uh, some people, if you go to the most basic form of it, it's a pig in a blanket. <laughs> All right. Look, but it's not, it's, but it's more than that. It's like, it could be deer sausage. It could be deer sausage with jalapeno or with sauerkraut. It could be, it could be ham. <laughs> You the idea. Well, I was driving along down 71. My eyelids were weighing me down. I had been up all night and I had to be up all day. I was beginning to think I wouldn't make it, but I did, so I'm here to say thank God for that little bitty truck stop in the grain. They got a damn good cup of coffee. And a mighty, mighty fine kolache From the girl behind the counter Pardon me, she's a mighty fine thing Well, I bought me a tape of some Ray Price gold It shuffled me on my way 
Thank God for that little bitty truck stop in LaGrange. That's right. If you're on that road and you're toting the load and your tail is a wagon behind, drop on by, tell them I said hi, to send you home down the line. They got a damn good cup of coffee and a mighty, mighty fine galoche from the girl behind the counter. Partner, she's a mighty fine thing. Well, I bought me a tape of some Ray Price gold. It shuffled me on my way. Anybody know where LaGrange is? We're talking about Texas LaGrange. God for that little bitty truck stop in the train. Oh! Oh! Yes! No headshot. In your face, son of a Hey, thank you, everybody. Appreciate y'all. Thank y'all for listening. Appreciate you. Hope to see you tomorrow. Best man in the world. Lone Star. Dale Watson, everybody. Are there any George Jones fans in the audience? Is anybody else Jonesing for Jones like I am? What do you think of that idea? He's sitting down. Let me think about it. Let me think about it. Oh, wait a minute. I'll only stop, stop, Christopher. I have to say, I will do that song only if four things. I need to know. Some George Jones fans are here. That wasn't one of the four. One of the four things is, what was his nickname? Awesome. Okay. No show. No show. No show. That's right. That was the second one. Boom. Good. Man. All right. It's good, it's good audience. Good audience. That's right. Hold on. Yes. All right. Third. George Jones <laughs> What are you doing, honey? She just gave the answer to the third question. I was like, well, she wants to hear it. Uh, and I've never gave this quiz before. Yeah, he had a nickname, a rockabilly. Uh, uh, he did a rockabilly record, and his name on that record was? Thumper. Yeah, Thumper. Thumper. You heard her, my wife say it. Never mind. She ruined it. Jesus. All right. 
Uh, all right, we're going to have to do five now. So you will do it then? Oh, yeah. He will yeah, do yeah. it. Oh, wait, 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 wait. No, you got to be up here. You got to be, you're a part of this now. He was married to. All right. Celine, please, in all due respect, please, honey, don't say nothing. Keep, keep. Please, baby, shut up. I love you. I love you. Please, just. What man here don't feel what I feel right now? It hasn't felt. It just ain't going to happen. Okay. Well, look here. The final question is, you know what? I'm gonna, Christopher, you're going to have to answer this. I'm putting you on the spot here, buddy. There's my man here. This man who made it possible for me to come down to California, period. So thank you, Christopher. Yeah, I really had to twist his arm. No, but it made, made, it, made it possible for me to even come to the West Coast. Thank you, my friend. But you have to answer this. I'm sorry I'm putting you on the spot, but somebody had to do it. Help me out. What is Tammy Wynette's nickname of country music? I'll give you, uh, I'll put uh, 10 seconds on the clock. Think about it. Tell me why that's a nickname. Lone Star. Best beer in the world. The only beer you should be drinking. That's... Lone Star. I have the answer. The first lady of country music. The first lady of country music. <laughs> you are absolutely right, sir. How many people thought it was a, a queen of country music? You're not going to answer. Yeah, never mind. Who's the queen of country music? Who said Loretta Lynn? You're wrong. What'd you say? Dolly? Wrong. Who said? Patsy Klein. You're wrong. Oh, it's people are Googling it. Kitty Wells. Ah, you're so close. <laughs> Electric or uh, acoustic? Electric. All right. Both. Some damn drunk got my cords all mixed up. <laughs> Can I file a complaint? I wrote this song the day after George Jones passed away. I started listening to every George Jones song I could listen to. Well, I'm Jonesing for Jones since George Jones is gone. How I look. Hear that possum moan, moan. Jones is for Jones Since Joe Jones is gone Thank God His music still lives on I heard a white lightning Sure enough made me glad I heard him sing the grand tour Oh, it's made me sad I'm Jones and for Jones since your Jones is gone, how I love hear that possum moan. Jones and for Jones, since your Jones is gone, thank God, and the music still lives on. Look out!
for them. Good. I, I, I mean, I, I went, went down and up. I mean, but I just tuned it by ear. I did. I heard the race is on. Sure enough made me smile. He stopped loving her today. It's on me off. Loving, loving, loving. Do it again. He stopped loving her today. You know what pisses me off? You're, you're in tune better than I am. You're a horrible audience. He stopped loving her today. You were so in tune. Thank you. Always made me cry. Hey, I'm Jonesin for Jones since George Jones is gone. How I love Hear that possum moan Jonesing for Jones Since your Jones is gone Thank God His music still lives on Yeah, thank God His music still lives on Thank you, everybody. I sure hope to see y'all tomorrow. If I don't see you tomorrow, it's only because uh, I didn't wake up in time. Anyway, <laughs> good night, everybody. Thank you, Christopher. I appreciate you being here. Hey, tomorrow night we're going to have Lone Star Beer here, uh, right? We are. Okay. We are. we are, plus we're going to have a dance floor tomorrow night. But if you don't want to dance and you don't have tickets for tomorrow's sold-out show, you can still stream it tomorrow right here on Stellar Shows and Concerts. Somewhere under 1,000 people are here tonight. Thank you very much, everybody. Everybody up there in the nosebleed section, thanks for coming. Especially you people all the way up there. Oh my God, like we have like almost 500 people up there in the nose, please. Thank you. How about everybody down here, you privileged people? Dale Thank Watson, you. everybody. Dale Watson. The Holy Grail. The Holy Grail of Honky Tonk right here on our stage. Golden loves so much she left. Whatever you do, don't get in the way between him and the bathroom after this two-hour set. God bless everybody. Thank you, guys. So that was so much fun. Thank you so much, Dale, for coming and doing this tonight. We are stellar shows at Jack's. That's our show, but I wanted to make sure that you knew that coming up December 12, we have Deke Dickerson and the Whippersnappers. And west of Texas, right here for one of our Hillbilly Jazz shows, Sunday, December 12, at a new time. The new time is 5 p.m. Hope you all can make it to that. And uh, don't forget Alice Wallace on January 21 also. Thanks again for coming. Thank you, Dale Watson. Thank you, Celine Lee. That's our show. Mm -hmm.